Hello, this is Olga from the Cisco Tag Team. In this video, we demonstrate how to access the web user interface on Catalyst 9000 switches. With the web UI, you can build configurations, monitor, and troubleshoot the device without the need for CLI expertise. The listed configurations are necessary to access the device web UI. First, enable HTTP. On Catalyst 9000 switches, HTTP is enabled by default, but you can verify it with the command show run pipe include HTTP. Second, configure an IP address to access a device with the management interface or switch virtual interface SBI. Third, authentication. In this example, we use local authentication. To do so, configure a local username and password to access the device. Having a count that privilege 15 gives you access to monitor and configure, and privilege 1 to 14 or omit the privilege option allows access to monitor only. Fourth, set up the client. Make sure your client is within the same subnet of the web UI IP address you want to access, or have reachability to the management interface with the default gateway set. Fifth, log. Access your internet browser and type the IP address you have configured for the web UI. In this case, it's interface VLAN 1 IP. Enter the login credentials you configured earlier. Now you have access to the web UI. You can navigate to the different options it offers, like monitor, Configure, and troubleshoot your device. I hope this video has been informative. Please check the Cisco Tag video portal for more content. Thank you for the time you took to watch this video.